first video of making the Alexa skateboard. Uh, I, if you guys want me to show you how I made the uh, motor mount and everything, I can make that a video, but this I'll just introduce the idea. So, everything we got is we got the motor. I've gotten everything except the only thing I need is my, the receiver and the remote. I have both of those things, but I ordered the wrong one, so I need to reorder those. I'll show you. I'll put that in the, des the, in the description in a couple of my videos. Not this one, because I don't have everything, but I, uh, I might. I, I might. So, um, I have the motor. It's a 2200 kV, I think. Yeah, 2200 kV. And so the way this works is I just kept this on. This is meant for an airplane, so I have no clue if this is going to work. Uh, put your wheel on, and then I had my friend drill this out, and then you put that in there. And then we'll secure that later, whatever. And then you put on the belt. Now it's a little loose because I need to tighten this. But this would go here and that would go there. And then it's all nice and tight. And then it spins around. So that's pretty much it. Uh, I'll show you like a nice montage at the beginning or whatever. So we got the motor. Um, then our nice uh, torque ratio, which may not even do that much torque. But, I mean, you never know. And uh, that's pretty much it. Uh, so hopefully you guys enjoy the series. It'll be awesome. Uh, so we probably have to, it'll probably start, like, in the next week because I gotta get enough money or whatever to order everything. And then I'll show you, it should, this, this electric skateboard should cost around 76 to $86. So, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. It should be one of the cheapest besides another video that I can put down in the, in the, in the description. And I'll also put it at the end of this video. So, I'll see you guys later. Bye. So today, um, I think I'm going to start a new project that I'm really going to probably, I'll enjoy and hopefully you guys. So I'm going to make an electric skateboard. So the first thing just came. Um, I'm going to unbox everything, just going to do a montage. All the stuff hasn't come yet, but I'll just do it quick because, you know, it'll be boring just watching me open it. So let's get started. <laughs> I opened it and uh, it's the RC receiver, so that's cool. I don't know what this is, uh, but let's open it. All right, so I guess this is the uh, electronic speed controller. So yeah. Okay, so I got another package today besides my ESC, so I don't know what this is, but let's see that. What could it be? Oh, it's my gear set. Whoa, these are tiny. I did not know it was gonna be that small. Uh oh. <laughs> that that must be like a bad thing. All right, so I think my motor came. So, uh, let's see if that's what it is. Yep, it was my motor. Woo! Alright, so I think this is the remote, so, uh, let's open this. Alright, so I did this all off camera. I'll have to do that later, probably with, um, a drill press. Um, but yeah, so, what I did is I just worked on the motor because I just got that. So, I put on this motor plate. It's not, like, even with the, with the motor, but it's fine. Uh, and then I just finally, uh... Uh, put that on. It's pretty straightforward. If you guys want me to do uh, how I did this, uh, then I can make that a separate video or whatever. So I got that on. So now all we got to do, which I think I'll make today, is the motor mount. So all I got to do is just drill a big enough hole to fit over here. And then I can just screw this onto here. And then I can fit the belt on or whatever. And then we know that works. And then we have to connect the ESC. And the only thing I need to come next is the remote. So yeah. All right. So I haven't really shown much. Like I've pretty much have stopped the uh, electric skateboard stuff um, but so what I've done is I've made the motor mount if you guys want to see that in the video something comment down below and I'll show you guys how to make this motor mount uh, so I connected the motor and then uh, that's really it and then right now I just need to uh, keep making this bigger so I can fit it over the nut and then I can show you the whole story really of of putting everything together and then all we got to do is connect the RC receiver and everything I just figured out that I don't think the SEMA and the Sky, the Sky something, I forget what it's called, uh, Skyfly or whatever, uh, RC receiver will not work, so we'll have to buy something else. I'll put that in the description too. If you want to see the SEMA remote and other stuff, then yeah, but that's what I've done so far.